Did you know that scientists have conducted extensive research on why cats purr? As simple as you might think it is, the truth is that there are many strange reasons hidden in it. Even if people often wonder about how a cat purrs, they rarely think about the reason behind it. They believe that a cat only purrs when it's happy or relaxed, but the truth is that cats have many mind-blowing purposes behind it. In fact alert, it is not only the domestic cats that purr. Big cats including bobcats, cheetahs, pumas, cougars, lynxes, and other wild cats also make soft buzzing sounds. So what's the reason really? Let's find out. The How Before moving on to why cats purr, let's have a look at how they do it. Yes, it is easy for us to make a meow sound. However, no matter how hard we try, we cannot mimic a cat, but still, we try, right? But purring, well, that's something we cannot ever do. That is because this trait is specific to cats only, in which air vibrates in their vocal cords. It starts with a signal from the cat's brain. The signal is passed to the larynx muscle and the diaphragm. Just like humans, the larynx muscles are part of the voice box. The diaphragm is a muscle that facilitates the breathing process by expanding and contracting the space inside the chest. The larynx muscles start to open and close continuously after the brain sends the signal. During this, the diaphragm regulates the airflow in the lungs. This continuous vibration of the muscles and the movement of the diaphragm produce a combined rhythmic effect which we call purring. If you observe your cat closely, you will notice that a purr reverberates through the entire body. This has some mind-blowing effects on the body which we will discuss later on in this episode. The interesting fact here is that while other sounds are produced by a cat when it either inhales or exhales, purring happens when the cat is performing both at the same time. It is important to note that purring is a separate process that does not interfere with the fundamental respiratory system. The why. So now, let's talk about why cats purr. There are many scientists who believe that purring is a voluntary act. That means they believe that cats only purr when they want to and that it is not something that just happens. This theory may be true because we often see cats purring when they are happy or want to be cuddled. But many other scientists believe that purring is involuntary and it happens when the cat experiences feelings of joy, sorrow, or pain. This also can be observed when a cat is sick and makes a purring sound when it is asleep. Cats are often observed to purr after falling from a height, being scolded by their owner, or even when hungry. This implies that purring has different reasons. None of the scientists can be called wrong because there is still a lot to be discovered about it, and scientists are still researching this. Even though we mostly hear a cat purr when it is happy or relaxed, a cat may purr due to various other reasons. This means it can purr when it is happy, sad, injured, satisfied, stressed, relaxed, or hungry. Stay tuned, because we are about to tell you some of the most fascinating reasons and purposes behind the act of purring. Communication The first is, a cat purrs to communicate. Whether a cat wants to communicate with another cat or with a human, it usually uses purring to do so. Cats communicate their feelings and needs to others by purring. Happy purr If you think all purrs are the same, you need to think again. There are different kinds of situations when a cat purrs. For example, you can identify its happy purr by observing its body language. If it is relaxed, has soft facial expressions, and blinks slowly, it is a happy purr. It conveys feelings of comfort and happiness. You hear your cat's happy purr every day when it is lying comfortably in bed and when you cuddle it. Cats also purr when they hear music, get their favorite food, play with catnip, or see something or someone they like. Many people say that cats purr when they play the piano because cats are known to love music and hearing the piano makes them happy. As a result, they purr. So we can say that one of the reasons for purring is a result of endorphins that induce happy feelings in cats. Distress purr Now, another purr is the distress purr. If you see your cat moving around restlessly while purring, it is a signal that something is wrong. It may be when your cat is in pain or stressed. The purr in this case is used as a self-comforting mechanism to calm its feelings. This is just like a human baby's self-soothing mechanism. Often when a baby is in pain or stress, it sucks its thumb or moves about in a left-to-right or front-to-back direction. Solicitation purr You may be thinking that there is another time your cat purrs. When it's hungry! That purr is a solicitation purr, and it has a very annoying sound. It can be identified as a combination of a purr and a meow sound. Furthermore, this type of purr conveys urgency, 
and has a compelling effect on your ears that forces you to do what your cat wants. Once you feed your cat, it stops the solicitation purr. Theories suggest that this purr resembles the human baby's cry. A human baby stops crying after getting fed just like a cat stops purring after getting something to eat. If you carefully observe, you will notice that this point is true because the pitch and frequency of both are almost the same. A human baby's cry has a frequency of 300 to 600 hertz, while the solicitation purr has a frequency of 520 hertz. This frequency analysis is enough to believe in this fact. Furthermore, you can identify purring as a communication mechanism by observing kittens. Since kittens are both blind and deaf, they bond with their mothers by purring. This is a way to tell their mothers that they are well or they need something like food or warmth. Moreover, small cats are often seen purring to bigger cats. This is believed to be a peace gesture by the smaller cat to avoid attacks and fights. Self-healing Another reason for a cat to purr is to heal itself. This is a miraculous fact that is supported by several studies and research. Some theories prove that purring is a natural healing mechanism. The point is proved by the fact that the frequency of a purr is 25 to 150 hertz, and studies have shown that vibrations of this frequency heal the body. If you have ever seen a cat falling from a tree, you might have seen it purr. This means that it purrs not only to convey its distress, but also to heal itself. In addition to this, if you have ever witnessed a cat giving birth, you may have heard its purring sound. This is proof that it uses purring as a self-calming as well as a self-healing mechanism. There is another study in which the purring sound of both a cougar and a domestic cat was captured and then analyzed for frequency. The impressive thing about it is that after analysis, it was concluded that both sounds had almost the same frequency. Several studies have proven that vibrations and sound have healing powers. That's the same reason why astronauts are treated with vibrations in NASA to improve bone health. You can find research papers on this topic in which this frequency has proved to reduce pain in the body, improve bone density, heal wounds, ligaments, and muscles, and even repair broken bones. Healing Humans Finally, the most interesting reason for a cat to purr is that it heals its favorite humans. Yes, cats not only use purring as a self-healing mechanism, but also as a healing power to make sure their favorite humans are fit both physically and mentally. Purrs ranging from 20 to 140 hertz have shown therapeutic effects on humans by lowering stress levels. Frequencies of 30 to 50 hertz have shown accelerated healing in physical wounds. Even though there is much more to be discovered, the things we already know fascinate us to make us wonder how much more there is to something as simple as a cat's purr. Which one of these reasons did you already know? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.